Hello and welcome to this video tutorial on how to use QLM 6.0. In this tutorial, I'm going to give you an overview of how to manage your license keys with QLM Pro. If you are using QLM Pro or Enterprise, the Manage Keys tab is where all the action is. With QLM Pro and Enterprise, a server component referred to as the QLM Web Service is hosted on a website. This component consists of a web service and a database. The data represented in the main view is retrieved via a remote call to the QLM web service. Let's examine the different features on this tab. The ribbon bar is divided into seven groups. The license keys group contains all the actions you take on a license key such as creating or releasing a key. The Fraud Detection Group provides access to two fraud detection techniques available with QLM. The Mail Group allows you to create email templates and send batch emails to your customers. The Web Service Group is where you configure the connection parameters to your QLM web service. The Tools group provides miscellaneous utilities that we will cover later on. The Cloud and Affiliates group is used to give your affiliates or software vendors access to data in your QLM database. And finally, the Backup group allows you to perform remote backups of the QLM database and easily restore it in case of a disaster. On the right-hand panel, you have access to a set of built-in searches or queries. For example, if I want to show today's orders, I click on the Today's Order search. You can create your own searches by clicking on Edit Searches. On the bottom toolbar, you have options for selecting all the items in the view or printing reports. The data can be displayed in two different view types, grid or card. Both view types can be fully customized and saved. To customize the grid view, select View Type Grid, then right mouse click on any column header in the grid view and select Column Chooser. This will allow you to select which columns to display in the grid. You can reorder columns in the grid by dragging them. You can also sort the data by clicking on a column header. Once you have customized the view, click on the Save icon on the bottom toolbar and enter a name for your view. To customize the Card view, select View Type Card Then click on the wrench icon in the card view toolbar. You can customize the layout of the tab by dragging items around. You can remove items from the view by dragging them onto the hidden items right hand panel. You can also create new tabs by right mouse clicking on the existing tab. Once you have customized the view, click on the Save icon on the bottom toolbar and enter a name for your view. Right below the ribbon toolbar, a Quick Search toolbar allows you to quickly perform a search on any criteria of your choice. For example, you can perform a quick search for a specific customer by entering their email as follows. This will return all the records that match the query above. You can narrow down a search by selecting the AND OR dropdown and specifying additional criteria until you see the expected dataset. If you want to save this search for later usage, you can click on the Search Save button.
Thank you for taking the time to watch this video.